Do you remember the first day that we met? Yeah, I think uh, we just knew a little bit together. Uh, you were in Paris, I was in Paris at the time. I um, text you to say that uh, I think I'm, uh, I'm, going, uh, I'm going out with some friends if, uh, if you want to have a drink with us. And then uh, you definitely say yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 no. First, I was, uh, I, I didn't want to do it. <laughs> hey, what's up? It's easier, it's easier, it's easier. <laughs> <laughs> All good? Yeah, very good. Yeah. <laughs> so we're talking here about the relationships. For you, what is it having a relationship in general? Um, you have a, first about a big relationship with your coach. That's the first relationship you have with your team. And then definitely uh, for me, it's easier because uh, I'm with you. So. It's a, it's a different type of relationship. Um, find uh, my soulmates in, the, in my sport. It was great you know, to, to also manage this type of uh, relationship as well. For me, I think um, before I met you, it was really tough to balance the relationship and uh, the career because obviously we are traveling pretty much 50 weeks a year and uh, it's quite tough, quite challenging, I would say. Especially I think for the girl because girl all the girls, we want love, we want uh, to have uh, someone um, all the time with us. So it's, it's quite challenging, I would say. But I'm really lucky to, <laughs> to have you <laughs> almost, almost weekly. <laughs> I will blush. <laughs> Can you explain us a little bit how you found the balance with me? I think we're quite lucky that you're also a tennis player because uh, we can uh, bring our team uh, and uh, be there for each other as well. So uh, having someone who is in the highest level as well, who understands and who shares the same, uh, same goals with you, that's, um, that's an amazing uh, thing in life uh, to have. And let's talk a little bit about the bad part, you know, because for sure they have some bad part, you know. The bad, the bad part is when uh, your partner is uh, training at 7 o'clock in the morning or 8 o'clock and mostly it's me training really early and uh, someone loves to, to have a 12-hour sleep. <laughs> That's quite tough. But I think we've been managing it quite good. And, um, but I think it's always finding balance and uh, being really quiet in the morning. <laughs> do you remember the first day that we met? I do. It was in Paris, actually. Um, Obviously, we knew each other before, but no, we knew it was a different, yeah. different level of relationship. Yeah, I think uh, we just knew a little bit together. Uh, you were in Paris, I was in Paris at the time. Uh, we have both different reasons, actually, so that was funny. And then uh, I, uh, I um, text you to say that uh, I think I'm, uh, I'm, going, uh, I'm going out with some friends if, uh, if you want to have a drink with us. And then uh, you definitely say yes, of course. <laughs> No, 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 no. The first, I was, uh, I, I didn't want to do it. <laughs> you see that? No, because I was so jet lagged after Singapore, and uh, it was uh, quite tough for me to stay, to stay awake. That's why, you know, when you when you hit actually the place, um, I make you wait a little bit outside. <laughs> but it was nice. It was in Paris, uh, casual. Um, yeah, it was. Uh, it was nice and it was the first time actually we could talk outside of tennis. Uh, we can really meet each other, met um, like the real Elena. And I think you, you could meet uh, the real me. I think since this first day, you know, we pretty much get along uh, very good and uh, been texting, calling and uh, say that uh, we see where the vibe's going and pretty much uh, be happy with that. Who came up with the idea of Gems Life? I think pretty, pretty much both. It, we, it was in Australia, both, you know, we. We just wanted to control a bit more how uh, we will announce it because uh, it was you won your second round uh, in uh, in Australia, and then you had this awkward question on the court, a little bit, and you didn't know how to manage it. And then we were like, uh, uh, maybe let's put it uh, on Instagram. 
and uh, with the name you came up. I came up with the name. Yeah, it was actually very smart. James, <laughs> James. <laughs> but uh, but it was more to at the beginning. It was more to control in a little bit uh, the way that we want this out, and and then we just had fun. I think with uh, with uh, with uh, Instagram account and and publish for our fan. I think uh, we just have fun and uh, we really like it. You know. It's cool to to have this kind of content because uh, um, it's nice to share with uh, with the fans something behind the scenes and uh, something uh, something different. I would say because uh, I really enjoy doing something. But something. Who, who is leading James' account? Me, obviously. <laughs> with ideas, you're coming up with some ideas, but <laughs> so where are you nervous um, the day that uh, you proposed me? Not at all, you know. Was confident. <laughs> I knew it now, you know. For sure, you get a, a bit of nerves. So it was, uh, it was not that easy to plan uh, a, a good one, uh, a good, uh, good spot, because uh, I had many ideas, as you know. And, uh, but then it came very natural, because to be honest, it was, uh, as you know, at the end, it was, uh, I don't really like to, to walk, and, uh, and uh, we went for a hike. For and four then, hour hike. Yeah, for a four hour hike and you know Elena's favorite and, and then I had the Google map and on my pocket but I have no connection so I couldn't find really the you know the area that I saw on Google Maps. So it was very awkward because I was looking back everywhere like oh maybe it's it's this spot but not really and then when I found a spot it was like a lot of people actually and it was COVID normally, you know, so it was tough and at the end I was just like uh, oh maybe uh, I will uh, I will freestyle in a restaurant and uh, and somehow Elena has just found a perfect spot, the best spot, 800 meters from the the parking lot, <laughs> and uh, and that I felt it I felt it that that was the moment and uh, and uh, of course I was very nervous and but uh, so were you more nervous than when you are facing Rafa in Algaraz? <laughs> Is it this kind of nerves or no? <laughs> It's not you confident because you know about your relationship, but it's like a, I know it's a, it's an important moment in your life. It's an important step, and uh, yeah, I was very nervous more than a match. Life it's uh, it's bigger it's bigger than our spot, obviously. So I was uh, really nervous and uh, really happy that uh, you know it, it went well, you know, in in, in the way. To be fair, when you asked me to go for a hike, it was a bit of a strange thing because normally you don't hike in the mountains so now i was very happy that it happened that it happened there that happened in that, this particular time so it was an um, amazing moment and i'm really really happy that uh, everything went well and for sure it's a um, it's a big step for um in our life um it's an amazing feeling with the wedding planner in, in our couple now yeah, i think 99.99 percent it's me and then there is Zero zero one percent is you. Just the music part. Just the music part is you. <laughs> I think uh, we already know uh, that what we want to do for for the rest of our life uh, is just a, a step forward and uh, and uh, a more official, you know, I think uh, thing that uh, that's going to happen. But uh, we will have still the same desire is like uh, to succeed and uh, how life and to succeed on the house sport so you know i think uh, it's going to be just even better you know in the way that uh, we, we will have more joy maybe let's go how you doing i'm good how are you good. felix you pay a coach but you want honesty and yeah. you want really transparency when you talk to each other you have to have that trust in them that they're going to give you the the best advice to to better yourself 